Hello and thanks for joining us. An E. coli alert has local grocery stores and restaurants scrambling right before the busy Thanksgiving holiday. The warning from the CDC has grocers and chefs getting rid of romaine lettuce. Reporter Meredith Hackler has more. Fresh produce isn't the first thing that comes to mind when we think of Thanksgiving. However, having a salad with your Thanksgiving dinner is still a holiday staple in many households. But if you're looking for romaine lettuce, you won't find it at a grocery store near you, like at Olmsted's Fresh Market in Crystal. We got emails during the night and to pull all of our romaine for safety's sake. So. The government's issued a recall, so we did it immediately. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says that at least 32 people in 11 different states have been sickened by a dangerous type of E. coli that is linked to romaine lettuce. The bacteria can't be washed away. Researchers found it embedded in the romaine lettuce leaves. It's not just the romaine, it's also the salad mixes that have romaine in it, you know, and then romaine hearts. Here at Olmsted's Market, you'll see signs like this regarding the romaine lettuce recall, but don't worry, if you're looking for a green for your Thanksgiving dinner, there are other options. Just about any other uh, mixed greens. There's so many different kinds of salad mixes now, so they just have to pick something that they would like and uh, go from there. And while the day before Thanksgiving is one of the busiest days of the year for Olmsteads, this is a real big day for us. We've got a mountain of special orders, and so as the day goes on, it gets busier and busier. How are you? We'll uh, do better than double uh, normal business uh, today. The lack of lettuce doesn't have them worried. I don't think it's not going to have a huge effect. Romaine is just a real small part of what we sell. In Crystal, Meredith Hackler, CCX News. If you have romaine lettuce in your refrigerator, throw it away since it could be contaminated. The CDC has yet to, deter to determine the source of the E. coli, and there is no word yet on when you will see romaine lettuce back on grocery store shelves.